Hello, Thomas from DCIV and today I'm reviewing the Speed Dragon 3 inch from Speed Drones. Now, let me go over for the set setup first. It comes with 1404 engines with 3800 kV. It has a Pro F4 all in one board and it comes with Gatix Vista unit. I choose for the polar lens so I can do the sneaky night flights and as you can see the frame protects the camera quite well. And to begin off with one of the pros, it's pretty sturdy. I flew different types of 3 inches and they all broke with the first heavy crash and this withstood the crashes with quality. And I think one of the reasons is that because of the camera build, the, the frame is built, but also in general it's a unibody. The unibodies break less, uh, but the biggest con of that is that you have to replace the whole body if something breaks down. And then I would, that would sum up the, the biggest cons of this frame is that it's a unibody. With, if it's damaged, you have to replace it. And second, uh, because it's up to 50, you cannot fly it in heavy winds. I did fly it in heavy winds and it, it, it could stew this ground. But again, it's definitely not recommended. And for who is this frame? I think uh, a starting pilot has a lot of fun with this frame because it's a lot lower risk. Um, you lot less weight will result in loss, less volatile flights. If you crash, you won't be likely to crash the frame right away or the object. So it's a lot safer and a lot easier way to step in. But for intermediate pilots, that sneaky bando flights or that office flights, or you want to do in general a flight where you want to be low key uh, and not pulling that much attention, it's, it's super great. It's a fun ripper. Um, and like I said, it's also a situation where you want to uh, take a lower risk, for example, when there's people or when there's close proximities and you don't have your scenable with you. I'll definitely pull out my tree inch. I flew it behind go-karts. I flew it uh, while getting tattooed inside, outside. It's it's just a very fun frame, but a very fun frame, but also very handy to just do to have with your bag. Definitely recommend it. Uh, a tree inch in in general. Uh, I didn't know a, a tree inch would that would be that much fun. Because it does feel like a 5 inch when you're flying it. You, you have the same capabilities and of course you feel it. Um, but after a few packs, it's, it's almost the same like a 5 inch. I definitely recommend the Speed Dragon uh, due, to, due to its dexterity. It's strong but also quite powerful. It's, it's not saggy at all and for packs I recommend the 450. It's recommended 650 packs for a little bit longer flying time but in my case I tested with the InstaGo 2 and it worked quite okay but as soon as I put the Action 2 on it with the 650 pack it became too sluggish. So I recommend the 450 packs in general and maybe have one to uh, uh, 650 packs extra. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments and if you want to have this frame, just email Bart and uh, he will hook you up. Yo!